I'm at the old abandoned train tunnel in Templeton. Um, it's April 28th, 2024, about 5.20 p.m. Just got here. I want to do a video going through it, but I forgot my flashlight. So I'm going to do a video of as much as I can see. Old abandoned train tracks. Um, this train, this train tr uh, tunnel is right along Mahoning River before it merges into the Allegheny River in Templeton. But as you can see, you got collapse over here. Um, I haven't been here for a couple years and I completely forgot my flashlight at the car. So I'm going to go in as far as we can see here. This is pretty nice. If I could see daylight at the end of the tunnel before I run out of light, I'll keep videoing it. If I can't, then you won't be able to see anything. It'll just be pitch dark, so I'm gonna stop the video and turn my flashlight on. I didn't see a date on the front of this uh, tunnel. I can't remember if there's a date on either side. Like I said, it's been a couple years since I've been here. But that's about as far as I can see with no light. There's no video or there's no light option to do video that I know of. Let me try here. Oh yes, there is. <laughs> New concept for me. I didn't know we can do that, but Yeah, you got that piece hanging. Looks like a looks like an exit way up there. This is interesting. I don't remember this being collapsed here last time I was here. So that might be a fresh collapse. Yeah, this is cool. I never knew I could video with, with the light on. Big caved in area there. Let's see if I can look at it better. You can see the concrete and the stone behind it. Interesting. Yeah, Templeton Tunnel from the railroad tracks. If I turn around and go the other way, about a mile, that's where Mahoning River runs into the Allegheny, and that's where the old power plant that shut down is at. So you're exploring with me. I usually walk through a tunnel beforehand, half the time for ones I haven't been in in years, make sure it's safe, but I didn't pre-walk this one, so we're just walking and checking her out as we go. This is up in Templeton, like I mentioned. I like finding abandoned places, bridges, uh, tunnels, buildings. Now, I do not purposely trespass. If it says no trespassing private property, I will not enter for any reason. If there's no signs and uh, no forewarnings beforehand that it's private property, then it's open game, then I go explore it. But this one is open game. There's no signs. Um, nice, easy going tunnel. I can see light at the end of the tunnel. That's good. 
not in bad shape at all for a walk. Um, as you can see, you've got little bugs flying around here and there. That's about it. When I'm walking tunnels for the first time, before I do videos, I usually walk through them to inspect them beforehand. I always look for eyeballs looking back at me. If they're low to the ground, it might be a, a fox, groundhog, something. If they're higher up, it's usually deer. I have yet to run into a bear that I know of in, in these tunnels. But, yeah, we'll get to the end here. Ooh, uh, stumbling over some of these. Now, I like these little coves there for when workers were in here, a train came, that was for them to get out of the way of a train going by. Oh, well, we got a good bit of collapse here. I don't remember this. Wow, you got a lot of collapse here. Hmm. Yeah, whole big section dropped. Now these are areas I don't want to talk and I don't want to be loud and do bangs or grab anything and shift anything to have more stuff fall. So I'm a little cautious around these areas. I climb up to the top of that maybe on the way back, but let's just get to the end to explore it. <clears throat> chunk that collapsed. I don't remember. But I'm always, always looking for abandoned places. So if you know of any, I mean, please private message me. Don't openly post it because I want to make sure it's safe. I want to make sure it's not private property before people go running there. Um, like I said, I do not openly trespass. Once or twice I've been on a property and authorities came up and I openly explained to them and showed them remarks that asking people who told me about a place, asking if it's private property or, or not. Um, anytime that says, yes, it's private, uh, I don't enter. If they say it's no, it's not private, or they don't know. When I go there, if I don't see any signs, I'll explore it. Once or twice, authorities came and talked to me, and, and I openly had to show them the history of the communication so they know I was, well, I was not openly trespassing and, and ask up front if it was okay to go. More collapse here. Yeah, this is, this is a little rougher shape than I remember from a few years ago. But it was a safe walk. We're coming to the end. Once I hit the end, I'm going to look for a date on the face of it. If there's no date, then I'm just going to end the video and I'll explore a little more and walk around some more. Okay. I love the history of our area with all the tunnels, the bridges, the trestles. I keep saying bridges, and I, and I mean actual bridges, but a trestle is a bridge for trains. That's technically called a trestle. A bridge is for uh, cars and a, just a walking bridge. But anything a train goes over, it's called a trestle. Okay, we're at the end. Let's see if there's a date on the face cover. Nope, no dates. All right. I'm at the abandoned tunnel in Templeton, PA. If you like it, let me know. If you got places, other places, please private message me areas and locations. I love exploring. If you want to meet up and explore areas together, reach out to me. That's cool. And we'll just go find places together.